All right, on today's video, we are back at the range, and today we are going to be running the Taurus G3 Tactical Suppressed. Now, I'm able to shoot this video today because I got Devin out here from Spectre Solutions. So I'm going to hand him the Taurus and let him tell you a little bit about this suppressor. So this is the rugged Obsidian 45 with a 9mm end cap. It's got a half uh, by 28 booster in it. So she should run 9mm. She should. <laughs> All right, let's get started. All right, now the ammo we're going to be using today, we got four different kinds out here. We got CCI Blazer. It's just 115 grain. We got the Aguila, 9 millimeter, 115 grains. Brought out some of my reloads. These are 124 grain Barry's bullets, sitting on top of 4.8 grains of CFE pistol. And we got a box of the Hornady Subsonic. We tested these in the Walther PDP Pro. They're super quiet, so we'll see how they run in the Taurus. All right, now. If you watch the unboxing video, Taurus did send an extra spring with the gun to run with the suppressor. So we did switch that spring out. We got 10 rounds of the 115 grain Aguila loaded up. Let's see how it does. All right, ran all 10 of the Aguila. Not too bad of a group. So far, so good. All right, this time we're going to shoot the 115 grain CCI Blazers. I think I got 10 loaded up. Might be 11. Math. See how it goes. We're going to shoot the bottom right target. Rain them all. Damn, things running great. Shot a really good group. Nice. Look at that. And you said you don't like red dots. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we got the 124 grain Barry's bullets loaded up. Got 10 rounds in here. I'm going to shoot at the top right target. You can already tell the difference. Ran them all. Definitely tell those were just a little bit quieter. All right, we've got 10 of the 147 grain Hornady XTP subsonics loaded up. These are definitely going to be the quietest. Let's just hope they run. Look at that. Group. They ran and they grouped really well. Holy poop. Look at you shooting a pistol. Oh my. <laughs> All right, my final thoughts on the G3 Tactical running and suppressed. All in all, it was a pretty good day. Now, we had some audio issues out at the range. But that's why we're back here in the reloading room doing the final thoughts. We only had that one hiccup when Christian was running the berries, bullets, reloads. I did pick the round up, and it did kind of look like it might have been another light primer strike. 
you know, we had that issue with the uh, herder's ammo and now that. Now all the factory ammo ran great. The Hornady subsonic 147 grain rounds ran great. So all in all, it's a pretty good day running it suppressed. Now the gun is absolutely filthy. We've got carbon and residue. we got all kinds of stuff going on here. So this gun's going to need a thorough cleaning, which I'm going to go ahead and do a cleaning video on it after I wrap this one up. Got a lot of blowback on the lens of the optic. But other than that, it was a lot of fun. Always love shooting suppressed. And uh, thanks to Devin over at Spectre Solutions for bringing out the suppressors today for us to use. So we're going to go ahead and wrap this video up. And we're going to go ahead and move on to the cleaning video. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one.